working to close the digital divide while making a commitment to students in the community. Hello and thanks for joining us. I'm Laurel Hess and this is Comcast Newsmakers. Joining me now is the superintendent of Royal Oak Schools, Sean Lewis Lake, and thank you so much for joining us. Thank you, Laurel. I'm pleased to be here. Talking today about uh, what has become a fairly unique partnership between the Royal Oak School District, a private corporation, Comcast, mm -hmm. and uh, not-for-profit organization who have all come together and collaborated to really improve uh, the lives of the students and the families in your district. We're very fortunate in Royal Oak to have the Royal Oak Foundation for Public Education. It's an all-volunteer community foundation that supports educational efforts in Royal Oak. That organization has joined with us as the school district and with Comcast to make sure that we're able to have families participate in Comcast's Internet Essentials program. So Internet Essentials very quickly is a low cost way of getting broadband, the internet, into families who qualify and the financial qualifications kind of coincide with uh, students' families who may qualify for free or reduced lunch. Um, and instead of just offering that and waiting for people to accept it or um, you know, say that that's something they may want to be interested in, you and, and your school district and this private organization and Comcast all work together to sort of make it happen uh, tell me how that all came together. Well, we had been receiving information from Comcast about the Internet Essentials program, and we were promoting it, trying to get families involved. Through those conversations with families, we realized that there were some barriers to their participation. Some of those barriers were process barriers. Uh, it was hard to go through the application process and actually get qualified with Comcast. And some of them were financial barriers. Even though it's a very generous program from Comcast, there is still a financial commitment that families needed to make. We began conversations with Comcast about the process barriers and were there ways that we as a district could help partner with our families and with Comcast to make it easier for them to become involved with the program. At the same time, we were having conversations with the Education Foundation. They were looking for a signature initiative, an uh, initiative that they could get behind to really make a difference and help the district and help the community. We brought all three parties together so that with Comcast, we were able to work together to lower the process barriers and really simplify the application process. So very quickly, tell me what you were able to do recently for 100 families, give them free internet for two years? For two years. Based and notebook computers as well. The foundation said, we'll take that low cost program and we'll make it a no cost program. District reach, uh, initiated a campaign to reach out to the families who would be eligible. We identified families, worked with Comcast to get them qualified. We had an event where we assisted with the application process. Just recently, just last week, we had 50 families into the building. Those families who had been qualified, enrolled in Royal Oak Schools, qualified as free and reduced lunch participants, we were able to provide them with a netbook computer and a commitment to provide them no cost home internet access for two years. How will this, or what is your hope, as far as what type of a difference it will make for the students now who were able to benefit from this? Increasingly in our schools, we're using instructional technology. Families can access student progress reports, student attendance. Students can access instructional materials online. One of the things we encourage families to do is to make sure there's a space at home that's dedicated to homework, to connections with the school. And you've been able to make that happen. Now, I'm now we can make that happen for families. Fabulous. Thank you so much for joining us. Thanks for this wonderful partnership and uh, for improving those families' lives. Well, thank you. For more information on today's topic, head to royaloakschools.com. Today's newsmaker was Sean Lewis Lake and the superintendent of Royal Oak Schools.